Cockroach, post number 118 from DonFensterWritings.com. I am a cockroach. I am neither proud of this nor ashamed. I am a cockroach. There is nothing I can do about it. I accept my lot in life. Fine. Good for me. As a part of my role, the human species, you, steps on me, chases me up wall and down dale, and sprays deadly substances on me. I don't mind. I'm okay with this. This is my fate, though I know that term is rather out of date nowadays. I can tolerate all this, but the one thing I won't tolerate, and this comes from a creature who says without irony, life has been good to me, is the bad press we've been, get been getting over the past few decades. I am talking specifically about the implied accusations that because we have a better than even chance of surviving a nuclear holocaust that we cockroaches are not doing our part to discourage nuclear proliferation. We're not like that. Scientists, weathermen, and a putrid assortment of other mealy mouth smartasses have written that if even one bomb drops... All life on this planet will cease except for a few species of algae and the lowly cockroach. Lowly. Italics like, italics mine. Lowly. Those motherfuckers. But let's ignore this profound rudeness for a moment and focus on the message. The implicit message is that, is that we cockroaches are opposed to or at least indifferent to the negotiations and verifiable treaties between the growing number of countries and other outlaw groups that possess nuclear weapons. We are not like that. In fact, this is a libelous falsehood. Just because we will survive and you will die a horrible death with your hair falling out and shitting brown bubbles in your pants and your eyeballs rotting away in your head from the inside out, Excuse me, I didn't mean to giggle. Doesn't mean we're all giddy and excited about mar and marching up and down the kitchen counter hoping for a start to World War III. With all our shortcomings, I think you'll find us to be one of the most forgiving, compassionate, and politically sophisticated of all the grotesque, stomach-churning insects on the face of the earth. Show us some respect and understanding. Give us a break. Step on us, but don't think you can walk all over us. Spray us, but don't, but don't hose us on the Discovery Channel. Remember, I could be the one tending your grave if someone drops an atomic bomb on you, when probably you'll be just a mere shadow of your former self. Shadow. Get it? Oh, shit. Is that me giggling again? <laughs>